Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Terrian Baseball again, bringing you another video in my Minecraft series. Now, as you last saw me, I went out here and dispatched of this annoying spider. There are some zombies out that way, so let's close this off. More zombies up there, and the creeper as well. So, let's go ahead and start digging out a little cave system. Now, I know that there's a cave system back here. Oh, there are some more creepers back there. Better be careful. So, let's try and connect to this cave system here. By digging back. Oh, you can't see anything, I think. That should be better. And we should hit our cave system any minute now. I hear a skeleton. More light. By the way, let me know if you would like me to turn up the game volume or if it's fine by you. Actually, this is going on too long. I think we should start and go in this direction here. Because I know there's a cave back here. Somehow we seem to miss it. This is getting increasingly strange. Well, there should be a cave system right behind us here. But, as it turns out, I'm just too stupid to find it. Which is very strange. So, okay. Let's do this the smart way. Go back here. And another spider. So the cave should be not too far from here. So let's see if we can hit it. Yes, there it is. Okay. So somehow I managed to dig my way right around the cave. Let's open up this edge and this part. And alright, we're in. Okay, better be careful. Put another torch down here. One here. Uh, I can see some stars out there. Oh, that's a possible entrance for monsters to come in. Let's put a torch here. Should be careful about this hole here. And let's see what we can find. Here's a skeleton out there. Ah, I see some iron down there as well. That's good. That isn't good. That's very bad. Actually, monsters could drop down on me any second. Better be careful. Mm, and we find a dead end. Okay, so much for that. Now let's make some stairs up here. That should work. Whoa! Damn it! Okay, I think I'm going to die here. Alright, so um, remember how I talked about uh, monsters could drop down on you any second? That was any second. But, well, no big deal. First actually recorded death on YouTube was proudly brought to you by Mr. Stealth Spider. Now, which way to go? I think I went that way. Yeah, definitely. Let's go up here. Ah, can you see it in the distance? There are the torches I set during our very first episode so I could find my way back home. There are some more spiders. Oh, no, you, you don't get me. No, no way. No way. Cannonball! And there. 
there's our first little shelter. So actually our new home is quite a bit from our spawning point. Which probably means I should be a little bit more careful in what I do. Unless I want to walk all the distance back to my home again. Well, it's getting day soon, so I think I should be I should be fine. But um I still have my crafting bench back in my old home. So let's just make one tool. And the one tool I need, oops, a bit of lag there. The one tool I need is a weapon, so I can defend myself. So let's just make some sticks. And I should have some more stone back in there, so I could quickly make a weapon. Mm, no stone, but I got a stone sword. Hmm, yeah, it's pretty much worn down, but it'll do. Alright, let's bring out the sword. Hope there are no creepers up there. Last time we went up there, if you remember, we got pretty much jumped. Okay, that's looking promising. Okay, no, up there, thanks. And actually, let's just dig my way up, it's way easier. Okay, now there's our big mountain again. Still, I'm still wondering how to call that mountain. So if you have any interesting suggestions, just leave it in the comments and we'll try and find out a good name for our new home. I guess we could call it, just call it The Rock. <clears throat> well, yeah. So, there's our home. There is the big hole. There are stairs I placed, so the spiders should be around here somewhere. Okay, better be careful. Whoop. No spider. Uh, a spider must be down here somewhere. It's been wandered off a little bit, but it will be here around somewhere. So, um, that's probably a dumb idea. Give me a sec to organize my inventory. Um, yes, I need my pickaxe and my shovel. Okay, seems like I'm good to go. Alright. Light. More light. Some more iron. A lot of more iron, which is great. And a lot of more darkness, which isn't so great. Ah, there's the, the part I patched up. There should be a torch up there. Great, so now we know where we're at. And let, let me just go ahead and quickly collect this iron. Three blocks, alright. And... Hmm! Ooh, creepy music. Yep, some more iron and some more coal. Let's get it. I wonder where the spider went. Actually, I better go and make sure that it doesn't hide somewhere in my home. That would suck. One thing to note about spiders, during daytime, they become passive. They will hurt you if you touch them, but um, they won't attack on their own accord. So um, you can just run by them or get the drop on them. Aha, <laughs> sweet revenge. Where the heck is that spider? I'm just going to get this coal first. Because if we do more spelunking or mine crawling, minecrafting, whatever you will call it, we'll, we're gonna need light. So that's a good piece of good amount of coal there. There is an entrance right above our house. Okay. Now where is the part I dug through. Ah, there it is, okay. So, that means we can close this part off. And let's use dirt for it. Because dirt is a very readily available resource. So let's go ahead and close this up so no baddies come, can come in here during the night. And if we place 
torch right here. And I also can't spawn here. Because monsters need total darkness to spawn. Hmm. More coal. I'm putting down these torches in intervals. I wouldn't normally need them. I could easily scrap this torch and would be perfectly fine, but in order for you to see better, I'm putting down a little bit more torches. Alright, another cave system. And it's going down there. No, I don't want to go down there, at least for the moment. And, hmm, we're out by the side, you know. Okay, so the house should be here. Alright. Okay, good to know. So, this is another possible entrance route for monsters. Mm. Which means I'm going to block this off as well. I want to create a, some kind of a mineshaft system behind my house, and I don't want monsters to be able to spawn here or outside and just walk in. That can kind of ruin your day. So, yeah. Let's have a look up here. Another cave system. Gosh. Hmm. How do we do this? One, two. Hmm. Let's do it like this. Yeah. There. There. Okay. Whoops. Never dig straight up. Gotta be careful. Alright. Let's get up here. Ah, damn it. Oh, Alright. Okay. More darkness. Great. And no resources. Okay. But lighting is good, so the monsters will spawn here. We'll get oh. down here and actually hurt myself there. Whoop. Yes. Whoa, a creeper. Go away. Go away, creeper. Go away. Alright. Loot. Actually, let me put my other sword down here as well, because this one is going to break anytime soon. And hey, we found some mushrooms. Which is a great find, because you can make mushroom stew with it. Wow, and the skeleton. Now that's bad, bad news, bad news, very bad news, very bad news, because skeletons are easily the worst opponent to face. So, um, yeah. Let's go good old Gandalf style on it. You shall not pass. Okay, ah, ah, ah. that's blocked off. And now, to mark this for later, going to have two torches in there. Alright, so we're going to come back to this location in a later video, because this skeleton's gonna get it. But I'll need some armor first. Well, some more coal. We can harvest this while we're on our back, way back to our house. And actually that's a very big find, so I'm going to leave some of the stuff here for the moment and go back and make some more torches. Alright, so that's our house. It's daylight now, so we can harvest some more of these nice little animals. And I think we're going to have our mine shaft somewhere in this general area. And in the next video I'm going to construct this mine shaft, at least I'm going to lay the foundations because I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to watch me digging down some blocks 20 times a row. That's going to get boring. So I'll go ahead and cut this. Alright, so, so much for this video. I hope you liked it. As always, if you have any suggestions what I should do, just leave a comment. So, yep, that's pretty much it. This is Lutarian Bearsbolt signing off. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.